Hello and welcome back everyone to another exciting episode of Persona 5 Tactica. We are still in the uh, second kingdom. We have lots to do. We have two quests and two new talks to do. Let's start with the talk. Another world. Let's start with that. Hey. Yuki-san, do you know anything about an alternate world? I'm afraid not. I've been living in this town since I was born. Here, people don't really think about what's outside. Was it the same for you, Arena? Yeah, for me, that country, well, world, I guess, was all I had ever known. If that's so, then I'm sure you were quite surprised as well. Hmm. Well, yeah. when I first heard the story from the Phantom Thieves and Toshiro, I was at a complete loss. But then when I thought about how there are worlds other than the one I know, I couldn't help but feel excited. I mean, the world you're all from is much bigger with lots more people in it, right? <laughs> Sounds like a wonderful place. No. I recommend not setting your expectations too high. The real world is pleasant, rampant with self-interested power mongers. You may not suddenly be dragged off by guards, but still, it's not much different from here. That's so. I see. Uh, I apologize. That was an in insensitive thing to say to someone who is suffering from living here. No, if that's how you say your world is, then I will take your word for it. But I believe that perhaps... Oh, but... That is the very reason why you Phantom Thieves stood up in the first place. That's right. But... Except what you did violates the rules of society and certainly cannot be. Well, it is undeniable that your actions help a great number of people. It seems things have been quite complicated. Not exactly. You're thinking about it too much, Toshiro. We all want to help people in need. Isn't that enough of an explanation? <sighs> Your simplicity is truly staggering. Oop, 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 oop. I know being boorish is in your nature, but how about you use your head a little more? What we call society is... Toshiro san, you like boars? Huh? Here at the Leblanc Tea House, we have a meal uh, we call curry that feature boar meat. I'll start preparing some right away. Would you <laughs> and Arena care to try some? Uh, I never actually said I like bear. A boar. Who's sure to say he doesn't want any? You can just give his potion to me. That's not what I'm saying either. I simply have my own preferences when it comes to curry. I like pork, so boar meat should be fine. Actually, I imagine the wild taste of the fat probably goes quite well with the roe. <laughs> well then, I'll start preparing some right away. Oh, by the way, Yuki-san. Thanks for letting us stay in here. Uh, leave cleaning the shop to us. Oh my, that would be such a help. While I'm making the curry, could I ask you to start on the seats and counter? And Toshiro-san, please take care of the toilet. Oh, why do I have to do those? Really? Huh? Toshiro, weren't you saying how good you were at household chores? Oh, and the tools are in there. Thank you so much. Alright, fine. Ugh. Ugh, why is it always me? But when you say you're going to do something, you do it all the way. Time to show everyone the Toshiro toilet cleaning technique. This is for the boar curry. Let's do this, curry kun. 3 GP is pretty generous, not gonna lie. Checking in the new outfit. Mm. Alright, we got our disguises. Now, just a little break before we start the operation. You know, this shop really is something. The town outside is total ancient Japan, but in here it's completely modern. There's even a TV. Right. It's thanks to that modernity that we can drink coffee. Cheers for LeBlanc. Oh. Wow, you totally freak at first, but now it's like you're a different person. You just accept things too fast, I have no choice but to toughen up. <sighs> so let me get this straight. First, you were a groom, and now you want to, you are a wanted criminal. I mean, I was a fugitive too, but they sure didn't want me as much as do, they do you. This isn't a joke, uh, what am I always the one? These things happen to... But if you're a wanted criminal, that means you must have committed some serious crime, right? Anything that comes to mind, Toshiro-san? I'm sure it's quite obvious that I have no recollection at all. There's nothing more unreasonable than being chased around for an unsubstantiated crime. I agree. Uh, that's right, you were being pursued by the police last year. Aww. We were in some serious trouble back then. There was even a bounty out on us. Huh? Also, if we handed over Toshiro, we could get loads of money as a reward. Wait, are you planning on selling me out? Too bad though, I don't presume you'll get much from me. Mm. <laughs> I think you could stand to have a little more confidence in yourself, you know. Excuse me. Hey Toshiro-san, 
Sasuke, Toshiro san did get captured. What do you think they would do to him? Hmm. We have no clues as to what this Yoshige character wants, but if we base our thinking on the ways of old Japan, he'd be sent to a prison house and whipped, made to sit on spikes, tied to uncomfortable positions, tortured in all sorts of ways. And after a confession they force out of him, decapitation if he's lucky, though most likely he'll be tied to a pole in front of a prison. I'm not sure what all that entails, but it sounds really bad. Well, that's why we're here, to make sure that stuff doesn't happen. Nothing to worry about. Right, Toshiro? Huh? Where did he go? Please stop. Don't say my name so loud. These are, there are cameras everywhere. Ah, he's totally freaked out now. He's actually wearing a, the towel too. He was so against it at first. You kids went through all the trouble picking it out for me. I couldn't neglect such kindness. Yes, that's it. But I'm begging you, noble phantom thieves. I'm innocent, so please protect me. You gotta be Wasn't he supposed to be a tough guy now? Anyway, our move is to infiltrate the enemy Sound base. Good? Once we start the operation, there's no telling when we will be able to come back. Keep that in mind as you prepare. The real GP. What should we choose? Yusuke got his mind in high places he asked for help. Hurry. Ryuji is curious about what's inside the wooden boxes around town. Mokoto goes with him to find out. Defeat all enemies within one turn. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is one of those puzzle puzzle mission. Well, you see. Something occurred to me during the last fight. Oh, what is it? Did you figure out the enemy's weakness? Or perhaps something else advantages to us? Of course. It came to mind when I saw the enemy fall from an elevated spot. It made me wonder what their view is like when they're falling. Really? Uh, what? I'm sure it's unlike any scenery we've seen before. Doesn't that intrigue you? It does. You should try falling too. Hey. Don't be silly. It will hurt if I fell from such a height. I tried doing a handstand to mimic the sensation, but it lacked realism. Plus, I couldn't sketch in that position either. If I could only witness it unfold up close, know what I mean? Um, don't look at me. Impossible. Why not? I thought you of all people would understand me. I might have the perfect thing for you, actually. I overheard the townspeople talking earlier. Apparently, the Eisen Squad has occupied an area of elevated ground nearby. Hey. We could take out the enemies there and fulfill Yusuke's wish at the same time. Good idea. That is a wonderful proposal. Well. As they say, best to strike while the iron's hot. Let's depart at once, Kari. Once you step outside, Yoshiki's camera will be everywhere. Try not to attract any unwanted attention while in your disguise. Let's go, let's go. Can I check out... Hmm. Oh, I actually could. Okay. I think we don't need... So this is our destination. I see. What a perfect height to have them fall to have them fall from. Alright, listen up. I think someone should wait at the bottom while the others fling enemies off the platform. At least that would be the most efficient way to deal with them all. <laughs> I can hardly contain my excitement. Let it rain, people. Now. I'll show no mercy. Alright. A little closer. Hey, fumble! Nice! Pets are joker! Yes. 
show you. Wipe them out. Prepare yourself. How do I... Mm. Resist. I missed two. Hmm. Okay. 
Left, wipe them out. Hold now. Nice. Keep it up. Nice. I'll show no mercy. All right. I'm perfectly ready. My turn. Oh. Now then. Not nearly enough. Nice. What to do? What to not? Show you. My turn. All right, I'm perfectly ready. A little closer. With this. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. You're doing great. I'll show no mercy. to do here. I'll cut them down. Whip them into shit! Okay. Oh, there's one that's still not hit yet. Wipe them out. My turn. All right. I think someone needs to... I'm perfectly ready. Persona! Oh. How about this? We do it like this first. Wipe them out. My turn. I'm perfectly ready. I'll 
let's see, let's see. Thing. That's it. I'll cut them down. Stop. Oh my goodness. A beautiful choice. Such is the way of the phantom. Oh, you two actually don't have that <laughs> person. My bad. I am deeply moved. The different ways they fell, their expressions, their voices, they all form a story inside mm. of me. Yeesh, I can't believe how many of them had to be tossed to satisfy an artist's twisted desires. I guess they were enemies we have to face sooner or later though. So I'm not complaining. This is incredible. I'm being hit with a wave after wave of inspiration. Okay. Oh, I wish I could let these feelings flow onto a canvas right now. Go all out. But unfortunately, I don't have any of my art supplies in this world. Instead, I shall burn this deep into my mind. Let's do it one no ten more times, shall we? <laughs> I'm bursting with passion, my creativity is on fire. Let's go back. Okay, I say it's time to ditch Inari and return to the hideout, don't you think? Okay, let's do one more quest. What should we choose? The mysterious box. I'll be counting on you. Hey. Does anyone remember seeing a strange looking box in the middle of the town? Mm. Oh, are you talking about that wooden crate? Ah. Yeah, that one. It's been bugging me all day. Bet there's something worthwhile inside. What should I do? It caught my attention too. If it's something that could be valuable in battle, maybe we should get our hands on it. Let's go get it. Yeah, I'd say it's worth looking on. However, although I suspect it'll be guarded by enemies, maybe smarter to bring the whole box back here. <clears throat> I'm sure it weighs a good amount. So we'll have to work together to carry it back here. No problem, I got you. Time for some treasure hunt. Right, let's go. Ooh boy, I'm getting excited. Let's go. I forgot to check what the requirements are. Is it one turn only as well? Carry wooden box to the target. In four turns? Pooping Haru. It is that crate is as good as ours. If I'm correct that the box is filled with supplies we can use, that has got to be pretty heavy. Let's transport it swiftly. All right. We can discuss our cut later on. It's go time. Do we have to bring it with us?
ready. I won't hold back. Ah! Oops. Okay. Gotcha. How you like that? You can't beat us. <sighs> we we did it. We brought it back. What a workout. Now let's see what's inside. Oh boy, I'm getting nervous. And open sesame. Oh my god. For real? What the heck is this? What? Don't tell me the entire box is filled with. Let's see. Ukiyo-e poster hand signed by Yoshiki. Romy the sets, figurines. It's a complete Blu-ray Blu setup. Lover sizing with Lord Yoshiki. What the hell? Like I want any of this. That is one heck of a losing ticket. You guys might want to check your treasure sensing radar. Well, it technically is treasure defensive, is, so what are we gonna do with all this? Sell it to them. Um, I'm good. You can have it all, Yuriji. Don't be shy. Do I look like I want the stuff? <laughs> hey, where do you think you're going? Uh, Akari, uh, any chance you'll be interested in some Yosiki merch? Hell no. Wait, don't go! Oh, come on, don't leave me with these. Uh, hold on a second. Somebody, anybody, take this away! <laughs> Alright, let's unlock some skills, baby! We get the spare Mega Booster. We get further increase the power of Phantom Charge. Actually... Enticing. Oh.
I'm afraid of dying. We should start investing on this side or here. I think I want to get. Oh, already got it. Full <laughs> throttle plus plus. I'm gonna save up to that. You skate. that's enough for now continue with the story so this must be their base now that we're actually here I'm a little nervous um you're trying to pass off as Aizen squad members right that's the plan Yuki gave us some sake to use as well the idea is for us to give them the sake so we can hold a banquet oh and some of these have water in them instead of sake, just in case. Don't get any ideas. <laughs> All right, now let's roll. Wait, what are we supposed to say to them? Um, ahoy? Ahoy? We have a search warrant? Achoo. Settle down, guys. Whatever thinking it. Those are way off. Who goes there? Uh, ahoy! We come with search warrants! If you're here to cause trouble! Please forgive our rudeness, sir. We are Lord Yoshiki's humble servants. Well done, Haru. Lord Yoshiki's servants? Indeed, sir. We came on his behalf to express his gratitude for your daily toil. The Aizen Squad members you see here were sent to escort us. That's what this is about. I wouldn't dare disregard Lord Yoshiki's thoughtfulness. Very well. Follow me. That was insane, Noir. You're the best. Thanks for saving our necks. Shh. You're welcome. But let's stay in character for now, okay? Oh, uh, roger that. I beg of thee. Forgive me. <laughs> let's just move on. Banquet Hall. There you have it. Now, let's enjoy Lord Yoshiki's generosity. Man, you just gotta mention Yoshiki's name and they'll believe anything. Just goes to show how absolute Yoshiki's control over this world is. Hey, now that we're in, we just need some intel. Right. But wouldn't it look strange if we all went around asking together? Divide and cook. Hmm. Having smaller groups may allow us to blend in and gather more information. Then let's separate into groups according to our roles. Eyes and Squad and Geishas. You can decide which group to join, Joker. Do whatever you think is best. I could go with Yusuke, Ryuji, and I. Alright, we'll start the plan once you finish deciding. Uh, let's go with Makoto's group. Understood. Good luck, everyone. Hey, Geishas! We need more sake! Come on, quick oh. now! <laughs> it's fine that we split up, but it seems there's no time to ask questions. We need to do something about this soon. This keeps up, I'm not sure how much longer I can receive <laughs> my fits. Very calm. Sorry. Right. 
something like this can be too worked up. I try to be a little more friendly. Hey, can you hear me, Keisha? Hurry up already! Oh no. This girl's so what? <laughs> um, Queen? <sighs> Sorry for the wait. One socket coming right up. How long do you need? Think of some other way to get the information we need. Perhaps the sake. That's the plan. Yuki gave us some sake to use as well. The idea is for us to give them the sake so we can hold a banquet. Oh, and water. Some of these have water in them instead of sake, just in case. Don't. What is it, Joker? Drinking contest. Let's go. What do you mean? Hmm? You mean? Oh. Oh, we can get those drinks ready right away. You see? Yes. Let's have a sake drinking competition. Whoever drinks more wins. More sake? <laughs> a little girl like you, there's no chance against. Because it really is water. That the winner says. How's that sound? <laughs> you don't stand a chance. Don't now. Well, in that case, we'll pour the sake for you both. Are you two prepared? Ready, set, go! <laughs> <laughs> Just water, after all. It worked! All that's left is... Well, it looks like I won the contest. So there's something I want you to tell me. Where can I find the control room for the cameras in this building? How do you know about that? Don't tell me the guys from the labor camp! You really think I'd tell you? This contest is... God dang it. Tell us. <laughs> Already lowered the background music sound, but it's still so loud. If you don't take the time to be rational, I need to lower it even more. Irreversible consequences. Rushing in head first. See, is it possible you envy her for being able to do that? Huh? Forgive me. You just seem to give me that impression. When I see Arena san and the others taking a stand for what they believe in, I think it's quite a wonderful sight. You must feel the same, Toshiro-san. Oh, but I suppose it's not my place to say such things. I... Uh-huh! Roger that! Leave it to me! Booyah! We've got the location! Sounds like they have the citizens in prison! 
prison there, too. Is everyone ready? Yeah, let's roll. We should get going. Yuki-san, please take care of yourself, too. <laughs> Thank you very much. We met up with the others. It's been a while. The Oracle's group is okay. We just have to wait and believe in them. Let's buy them as much time as we can. Yes. Ideally, we'll be able to escape before they catch on to us, but... Hey! You! What the hell are you doing? I... I'm so sorry, sir! Please forgive me! Is that...? You spill my sake and you think you're gonna get off with an apology? You wanna go back to the basement that badly, huh? Uh, no! No, please! Anything but that! Any longer in there and I'll... And you what? You saying service for Lord Yoshiki is a burden? No! I wouldn't dare! Please, forgive me, sir! Even here, there's still... Oracle, we've got some trouble. How much longer? Just a little more, right past this door, and... Wait, a lock? Sorry, just hang tight for now. What? Hey, let's have some fun and make this guy squeal. Oh I my god, these guys are the worst. I like the sound of that. It'll be the perfect side piece for my sake. <laughs> this is getting bad. We have to stop them. Wait, I, I know how you feel, but we can't... Please. Have mercy on me! <laughs> Is someone a little scared? We have to help him. Oh, you just need to shut up and quit your pitiful whining! <laughs> Can't you fools understand? You're nothing without Lord Yoshiki's love! Maybe some punishment will help get that through your thick skull! Uh, this is looking really bad. How much longer, Oracle? Oh, I'm so close! I just gotta do something about this password! Sorry, but I'm borrowing this for a moment. Whoa! Oh. Hey, Pops, what are you... Huh? <laughs> huh? You got a problem, girl? <laughs> all right! Looks like we're all set on our end. Ball's in your court, guys. Huh? What now? You want me to punish you, too? <laughs> Shut up, you sick bastard! <laughs> Doing. I'll cut you down. Oh, damn. Silence. You were the first to break the code of chivalry, were you not? <laughs> yeah, now this is more like it. I'm to go wild. You we'll show them what a little geisha can really do. Intruders! <laughs> Sorry, I told you to hold. <laughs> no, that was really cool, Queen. Besides, from here on out, I'm not holding back either. <laughs> you low lives have no sense of morality. I'll cut you down to your rotten cores. You think you can lay hands on us without Lord Yoshiki? God. Lord Yoshiki this, Lord Yoshiki that. Ugh, just shut up. You don't scare us. Your tyranny ends here. 